All right, so uh, without waiting further, we, we should start. Uh, thank you, David. Thank you, Lucas, for uh, confirming you, that you are able to hear me. Uh, I'm going to conduct the webinar. I'm, uh, I'm Vikrant, as most of you are familiar with me. And uh, today's webinar is going to be dedicated to retail solutions provided on the basis of EO Cortex. Few words about uh, our company. Uh, we have been in business since 2008, and all this while we are able to develop 19 intelligent modules that can be implemented to enhance the security setup. Apart from that, 5,000 cameras we have already integrated with our system, and with the with the help of Onwif and PSIA, you can always work with any camera. We have kept our uh, softwares very simple, so you don't need special skills to work with it. Just 10 minutes uh, dedicated time would be enough to do the installation and configuration. Then, uh, with the all these achievements, we are able to capture. Uh, markets of 30 plus countries and we have strong hold uh, on market in these 30 companies with the help of 5000 plus distributors and system installers which are our partners with the help of these partners and uh, distributors we are able to implement 23000 projects uh, which included 300000 plus cameras in doing all this, uh, our partners were able to get personal training and certification and uh, the training was related to technicality of uh, software as well as sales. Then we are able to provide pre-sale service free of cost without any extra charges. Technical support is always for free. Once you have purchased the license, you will be getting lifetime technical support. If you are purchasing any software right now, license right now, and you get the software downloaded, and the next time you're going to download, you don't need to pay anything extra as all the updates uh, will be free of charge. And these are the countries that we have presence in, uh, Czech Republic, Germany, Italy, Denmark, UAE, Saudi Arabia, South Africa, India, we have presence in Belgium, Spain, Luxembourg, UK, Portugal, USA, Kuwait, Iran, Tunisia, Pakistan. These are few countries that we, uh, we have already captured. And we are going to go further to bring more projects, from, uh, not from these countries, but other countries which are uh, dealing with sophisticated, intelligent modules running on the server. Few brand names have been marked here like Avigilon, Access, Bosch, Brickcom, Cisco, Dawa. These are prominent brands which uh, are the uh, manufacturers and developers of cameras and we have successfully done integration of models coming from these brands. That is not all on and PSIA as I have already specified. Uh, is something that we keep check on and we are making our system compatible with ONWIF and PSIA standards. So if your camera is complying with these standards, it would be working with EO Cortex. EO Cortex would be getting the stream from these cameras using uh, whether the integration uh, plugin or uh, standard and then we'll be performing analysis on the stream. As this uh, webinar is dedicated to retail solution, so there are certain questions that, that you have to face when you are dealing with any project uh, dealing with retail uh, enterprise. And these questions are answered by EO Cortex. So the question for first of all would be to keep check on any hazard uh, that could cause financial uh, damage or uh, property damage or human uh, life casualty. So fire and smoke can be really big thing. Uh, 
that needs to be cared in case of retail solution. Then security is another. Uh, if uh, you, your uh, enterprise is not secured enough, it is allowing anyone and everyone to come through from any part of the uh, boundary. Then you, you have laps in security. And uh, our solution can provide you with that solution as well. Uh, I will be talking more in detail about these things later on. Then uh, something that has been left intentionally or accidentally would be much of concern of yours as uh, it could pose security hazard uh, or uh, it could be a uh, plan of some terrorist organization to uh, explode something so you you need to be aware of what has been left which is which does not belong to the uh, uh, to the, to the enterprise then security is another thing which uh, is mainly provided by the employees working in stores or in particular section uh, so you need to make sure that employees are at their work uh, station or um, the allocated spot if uh, something has exploded you need to be aware of it you should get notification you should get information what has happened which has caused loud sound if there are too many people gathering which could be dangerous to the property uh, you should be aware of it you should get some kind of intimation about it uh, beforehand then as it is a, a retail solution you need to care about the customers and customers lengthy queue can be inconvenient for them to stand for long hours uh, so to diffuse that uh, you we have solution for that as well if camera has been manipulated or uh, so someone has played with it or it has, has started to malfunction by itself you should get uh, notification about that as well so uh, our solution will be providing you such notifications as well you will be looking for number of visitors to get the estimate of what time in the day most of the visitors are coming in and what time the, uh, the, there is less uh, number of visitors visiting the center you might be looking for some solution which can alert you about VIP customers on the basis of recognition of face then what routes uh, normally visitors take where they, they uh, stay for long this information will be crucial for marketing team for team which is uh, into promotion then uh, there could be possibility big, big enterprises uh, could have big area uh, and little kids uh, would not be able to get back to or navigate themselves around and they can get lost uh, or they, they can stray away from their parents and uh, here our solution can help to find out kids uh, who have gone astray from their parents then there could be activity uh, that needs to be investigated and you are aware of about the appearance of some sus uh, suspicious individual and you need to investigate then our solution will be handy to work with such investigations and to uh, get evidence to present it to the uh, police uh, or investigating agency then parking is uh, another spot that needs to be managed and uh, our solution can help you get uh, license plates recognized and then further you can manage the parking spot that is attached to retail uh, enterprise and uh, if you are going to work with uh, EO Cortex then scalability is not an issue large areas can be captured 
uh, with n number of cameras. If you are going to work with uh, small enterprise, then we have solution for that. If you are going to work with uh, really supermarket uh, like uh, establishment, then we have solution for that. Multiple cameras can, can be uh, connected to single server or multiple servers can be brought into one setup and that would be all that you need to do to secure the area and make use of features coming with your Cortex. I guess I have already answered for on your behalf that you, if you have such questions you would be saying yes and your Cortex is here to uh, vouch for your yes and we will be providing you with the solution that will be providing all uh, answers to all the questions which were listed in the previous slides. Smoke and fire uh, is here with the EOCortex that you can work with then tracking is there, crowd monitoring is there, people counting in queue solution is there as well face recognition, heat map is there, people counting, license plate recognition. Uh, if you want your server to be up and running all the time, failover solution is also available which can be configured to work uh, in a manner that uh, there would just be lapse of 10 seconds between the failed server and standby server to take its place. Phase detection is there, audio stream processing, loud sound detection, suspect search to investigate if any felony has been done. Fisheye developing is one solution uh, which will help you to capture a really large area using fisheye camera and then develop that uh, so that you will have good image. Um, which is really good for humans to understand well. Personnel monitoring is also there. I'm going to take you to my screen now and would be giving you demonstration of all these and would be talking a few words about these intelligent modules. Smoke and fire is the first one that I'm that I'm uh, bringing up. Here you have smoke and fire intelligent module which is very easy to uh, configure. You will be getting alerts regarding fire or smoke whichever would be observed by the system. If there is a, uh, smoke you will be getting notification about it via SMS or email and uh, it, it will be definitely helping you to prevent fire and smoke from spreading as uh, somebody would be taking care of uh, once notification has been received. If there would be any evacuation plan that would uh, will also be carried out by the management once notification has been uh, has been received by, by the appropriate individual. Further investigation can be carried out as well. As uh, all the instances will be. Uh, recorded in journal and you will have access to uh, journal and archive will also be mapped to that journal. We have got another intelligent uh, module which is called tracking and tracking will be helping you to uh, secure the perimeter. And you will be getting notification when somebody is trespassing the zone. Or if you have uh, set up a tripwire and on the intersection of that you will be getting notification. 
uh, Udit, I will be taking your questions later. Uh, so I, I will request you to please hold on to your questions and I, uh, keep them reserved for the end, for the end. So here tracking is functional. So illegal tra trespassing can be avoided by setting up zones as zones can be configured so that lengthy presence can also be in, uh, informed to the authorities and action can be taken. Now loitering uh, could be considered as lengthy presence and if somebody is overstaying in a spot where usually people are not supposed to then you will be getting notification and you can take prompt action against that overstay. There would not be any limitation uh, to number of zones and in, uh, tripwires that you can set and camera, single camera would be able to accommodate multiple zones and intersecting lines. Then we have abandoned object which will be helping you to manage the uh, enterprise or area under surveillance and it will help you to keep an eye on any left object which is unattended. Any left object uh, could be uh, danger to the visitors. So prompt action can help you to prevent any terrorist attack. And if something has been noticed beforehand, you can inform the authorities and make sure that uh, staff and customers are safely evacuated. And if you have such notification thing uh, then you will be able to investigate look in archive who was the culprit this way uh, you will be helping the authorities to uh, resolve the case uh, related to any anything that that could have been danger Regarding this intelligent module, I can say that three different zones can be set. So single frame or view can be used to manage three different zones and for each zone you can define minimum and maximum size of the object that should be considered as left object. Next intelligent module that, that we will be talking about is phase detection. Uh, this is how it is going to inform you. If uh, configuration has been done, uh, you can get notification via SMS, email or on your mobile phone as well as push notification is also valid. Push notifications can be received via SMS, uh, sorry, uh, on your uh, iPhone or phones based on Android. Here we have face detection. Uh, face detection will be keeping check on all the faces that would be seen in camera view. If you need to investigate, you can go in search 
and request this system to provide all the faces it has captured in the archive of the specific camera. If duration has been mentioned correctly, channel has been selected correctly, then you can perform the search and system will be providing you uh, relevant information that you are looking for. Next to this uh, would be suspect search and tracking. One intelligent module which can help you to uh, to get the kid back to his parents uh, if he is lost in your uh, setup where, which is covering retail solution. Here we have something uh, which is uh, managing four cameras, uh, the grid of four cameras and we will be using suspect search to look for individual. Sample can be defined, uh, a sample has already been mentioned there. Right now, the system does not have data enough. Uh, in last one minute, system has been able to capture these humans. I can run cross camera tracking as well. Now with five frames that I have selected, I can view the activity of this individual. I can view it in video as well as where clips have been taken from different cameras. So by using the appearance of one individual or marking one individual, I have, I have been able to track the movement. And had there been a kid, a lost kid, I, I would have been able to successfully locate uh, his or her movement and would have helped me to bring that kid back to his or her parents. It took me less time uh, to just specify the appearance. Once that was done, system did all the job by giving me suggestions uh, and on the basis of those suggestions, I made the choice uh, and confirmation also done by me to specify that uh, this is what I am looking for. And then system gave me results in form of slides as well as compiled video. Other intelligent module that, uh, that is loud sound and loud sound is something uh, that you would be interested in as in stores generally you would not be getting any kind of noise other than what is coming from the promotional campaign. And uh, with intelligent module which can detect loud sound will allow you to set the threshold. Once uh, sound will breach that sound hole, uh, threshold, then you will be 
able to get notification. So you will be informed about any anything uh, that has caused that loud sound and will be giving you information where and which camera you have to look at to investigate further. In archive you can get more information what actually caused that sound. Crowd monitoring is another intelligent module that would be really helpful to get notification when, when unexpected crowd gathering is happening. It is going to be great tool to help you disperse the crowd which is not supposed to be there. Maximum number of in, uh, individuals allowed in a particular area uh, should be specified. If number would go beyond that, uh, you will be getting notifications and alerts. You can also configure the system to warn you before crowd reaches the maximum number uh, which is allowed. Face recognition uh, is another intelligent module uh, that can help you to cater better to your VIP customers as it will be informing you about the presence of someone you have put into your database as VIP. With such an intelligent module you will be able to provide a good service to frequent customers who are uh, really good for your business. Apart from that, if you want uh, someone who is known for felony or was, was uh, involved in wrongdoing in the past, system can alert you about that as well. So you just need to create a group where people with malicious intention can be put in and you will be getting notifications so that the moment they enter uh, the premises of a uh, retail shop, you will be getting notification and you can inform authorities about it. So it can also be in, uh, utilized to get the attendance of employees as it will be providing biometrics uh, recognition to, to um, manage these attendance of the employees. Creation of database is as simple. Uh, it is going in with the lines of uh, keeping the system simple. And report page will be giving you all the information of recognized and uh, unrecognized individuals that you can use in the future. If you you going to click on any entry, you can access the archive and investigate further. So it can be configured with access control systems. And can also be used to get notified of any person's uh, presence in the retail outlet.
license plate recognition would be of great help to manage the parking lot uh, which is necessity of any retail outlet as uh, customers would be coming with the, uh, with their uh, vehicle and you need something to manage it and we provide a solution with which does not need human interaction to recognize license plates if someone has been known to be disruptive to business activity you can bar them you can even uh, stop them to enter the uh, parking lot itself leave alone uh, they are getting into your retail store so first instance of their uh, vehicle appearance in camera view would be informing you apart from that uh, if somebody uh, comes in uh, and uh, system needs to keep track of anyone and everyone then then LPR would be really beneficial in that case database creation is again easy you don't need any special skill and you will be able to access the data collected by it getting verification is quite simple as well this uh, variant is working on high speed moving vehicles uh, as uh, license plate recognition come in two variants parking and highway parking will be working on vehicles running at uh, speed not more than 20 kilometers per hour whereas highway would be helping you to work on vehicles which are running at uh, high speed up to 150 kilometers in uh, retail solutions you will mainly be dealing with parking and uh, with parking you you will be able to integrate barrier system as well once that has been done system can take prompt action to reserve the area for staff which would be across the barrier system so registered vehicles will only be allowed to park in reserved area which might be for VIP customers or employees all retail solutions will, will be interested in getting the number of people coming in and people counting uh, is one thing that you might be interested in and might be interested to pitch to your prospective uh, clients as it will be keeping check of people coming in and going out of uh, the premises and we have uh, developed our own hardware which uh, pro can provide you accuracy up to 99% this module is also capable to upload the report that might be needed to have understanding uh, when in the daytime most of the people are visiting so that staff and employees can be provided to serve each and every visiting customer satisfactorily another intelligent module is audio processing audio stream processing uh, needs to be there for you to get sound from the mic connected to the camera and it will also help you to transmit sound 
from the client machine to the speaker connected to any camera. Uh, this way you can make public announcements and you can also record the sound that is uh, generated in the camera view. Now the, there was a question uh, from Udit about personal monitoring and I am bringing personal monitoring up. Personal monitoring is one module which will be working to inform you if uh, somebody is not at his or her designated spot. Here you have four designated spots and if there would not be in activity, uh, would not be any activity in these spots, you will be getting notification. Uh, right now, a visual notification will be provided to you, but if you have done appropriate configuration to send you push notification or uh, notification via SMS or email, then you will be updated about the activity happening in the zone. Six different zones can be set by this intelligent module. So personal activity monitoring is going to help you to secure the area which needs human presence all the time or some sort of activity all the time. Retail stores might have security guards uh, who are supposed to be present next to counter all the time, cash counter I mean, uh, and if they are not, then you will be getting notification. The, each zone can be uh, configured to allow inactivity for a certain duration. As you can see, low activity zone has been detected. This low activity uh, notification can be used by manager to investigate why somebody is not present at his or her designated spot. And retail solution without keeping in mind uh, satisfaction of visiting customers would not be of any use. So people counting in queue would be solution to work with. And when you are with, uh, working with people counting in queue, you can set up zones and six different Cues can be maintained by a single camera. This module can be configured to notify you if there is lengthy stay of uh, customers in the zone dedicated for queue. Report can also be fetched. And system will be again notifying you. You can set up that uh, 10 people are allowed in a, uh, in a queue to uh, wait. Or that their wait time should not be more than one minute. There should be some activities that, that uh, the cash manager or uh, manager at counter 
should be able to deal with each customer within one minute's duration. If uh, that is not the case, you can take prompt action to diffuse uh, the situation so that it would be a good experience for visiting customers. Multiple zones can be set, uh, up to six zones can be set. Heat map is another solution uh, that Eocortex provides to have the understanding where most of the visitors are staying or paying attention, which uh, route uh, they normally take so that promotional stuff can be placed there. If a heat map is there, you can fetch reports and report can be used to, in, uh, to have the understanding which route is more mainly taken up by the visiting customers. You don't need any special camera, regular IP camera would be enough and uh, the stream coming from it will be used by our intelligent module to give you results. Right now you are looking at live results and uh, red color would show you highly active area. And blue color shows least active. Once uh, this module has been configured, you, you will be in a uh, position to have understanding which products or which stalls are mostly visited, uh, which uh, rack is mostly visited, which product is getting more attention from the visitors. It will also help you to uh, set up the stalls. Then another uh, solution uh, that Eocortex offer is failover. Now failover is something which provides reliability which will be helping you to uh, keep the system running all the time. There will be standby servers, dedicated standby servers which will be taking up the cameras uh, when the, uh, the cameras, uh, the servers that, that those cameras are connected to go uh, goes down. Once that has happened, a uh, system will be able to still uh, work with the cameras and will provide you with seamless archive as well as real time viewing. So, failover is essential for 24 into 7 coverage of, uh, of the area if, uh, if anything happens to the hardware there would be something uh, as standby to take its place and still you will have up and running system. with access to real time as well as archive of the cameras. So it will reduce uh, the, the loss of footage at the time when any server goes down.
PTC camera control is another module that EOCortex offers and uh, this module will be able to help you to zoom in and out pan from left to right if uh, uh, wiper is part of the PTC camera it will help you to instruct that to clean the lens or the glass if uh, you have set uh, the track or uh, patrolling you can manage that with EOCortex presets pre-configured presets can also be used to set up patrolling route for the PTZ camera if you need hardware joystick or keyboard to be used uh, with PTZ camera that can also be done as a system will accept any plug and play USB uh, keyboard or joystick apart from that if we integration is needed of any device we are always open for such integration provided project has been awarded to us fisheye developing is uh, another thing that that needs uh, a solution as a developed undeveloped image would not be easy to look at and to investigate it would be really uh, useful if you have a fisheye developing module which can develop the images coming from camera and if this developing module is able to get you images in multiple modes that would be better than uh, the spherical image that you normally get from uh, fisheye camera right now you are looking at fisheye camera uh, spherical uh, image and your cortex solution can help you to develop it in multiple ways and these uh, developing methods will be applicable on archive as well if you are in archive you will be able to use joystick virtual joystick to pan from left to right and virtual PTZ is another mode that you can work with all these uh, developing methods will be applicable to archive as well Sabotage detection is another thing that you need to be careful about as uh, physical damage done to camera might not be uh, notified by the intelligent module uh, but EOCortex has overcome that and has provided you with this solution called sabotage detection uh, which will cover defocusing of lens covering of lens if uh, any high beam has been flashed into camera lens that will be seen as uh, sabotage if camera has been panned in different direction that will also be covered as sabotage if uh, cable uh, has been cut or uh, the data cable has been taken out then it will be seen as sabotage so you will be uh, worry less when you are working with EO Cortex and you have sabotage detection working on all the cameras so you will uh, be notified of any physical damage done to the 
uh, your devices helping you to cover the area apart from these uh, intelligent modules you will be in position to view uh, remotely the cameras connected to the VMS managed by EOCortex uh, you may use Windows devices you may use uh, uh, iPhone you may use uh, phones based on Android and you will be able to access real-time archive will be able to manage PTZ controls if you are working via uh, web client uh, you will have access to all the, these things as well you will be able to take screenshots and uh, if you are uh, accessing archive and you want to run through it you can increase the speed or if you want to look at it uh, really slowly with you want to run it in slow mode uh, then you can do that as well so speed can be uh, increased and decreased as well of archive playing you will be able to get push notifications on your Android phones and uh, phones based on iOS uh, I have one more thing to show you uh, this is our new development our Russian department is doing then I will be moving to question and answer section so that I can help you with all the doubts that you might have So this is a new product that uh, we are working on and we are open to launch it and you should not get confused with the name Macroscope here as this is our brand name uh, in Russia. This is the legacy name uh, which was used in international market as well. We have recently developed uh, hardware uh, uh, robot which can help you to identify gaps in racks so that uh, those gaps can be filled with, with products uh, if there is any change in plan the way products are uh, displayed then you will be notified about it if there is a uh, incorrect tag have, uh, or price has been mentioned or uh, price tag has been moved you will be informed about it you will be getting these uh, information on your mobile device or via excel sheet uh, you will be getting that so notify you will be notified by a robot and if you are interested in uh, such product please contact us uh, we are robot at microscope.com and we would be eager to help you out with that I am leaving email account email account uh, which has been proposed for Uh, propose for the, this uh, de uh, development that that we have recently done and uh, I will be asking you few, few questions and uh, I hope uh, that would not be too much if you have received such requests from your customers for retail solution uh, or not uh, please specify that if uh, you think that uh, it can be uh, can be a solution to demand which is there in your market 
and if you have any uh, any suggestion to make for the improvement of such solution we are open for that as well and if you are interested to uh, pitch it to your customers prospective customers uh, or not Uh, these are the questions that I would like you to answer or we can send you a questionnaire which you can answer to at your uh, own will. Now let, let's uh, move to questions uh, related to retail solutions uh, or the webinar the, that it was about. Udit, I hope this uh, answer, the question has been answered. You were satisfied with the answer? Uh, your question was what is personal monitoring how do we define it how many lines can create for people counting for single camera as I told you that six zones can be set and six zones will be dedicatedly working on area which is for any particular counter or you consider uh, to be an area where line will be formed. So six lines or queues can be managed by a single camera view. Any more question? Kuma, your question is uh, will failover automatically switch to archiving? Yes. When you have failover module running, system will take the responsibility, the standby system will take the responsibility of recording server and will perform archive as well for the cameras which it will be responsible after the instance of failed server. Uh, Udit, your, your next question is uh, do we need special cameras uh, for these tasks? No, we don't need any special cameras. Uh, we just need simple camera the IP camera which can transmit stream and EOCortex can process it. Uh, stream should be in format of uh, H.264, H.265, MJPEG or MPEG4. These are the four formats that EOCortex supports. And these are what mentioned in uh, ONWIF as well. Uh, I'm sorry, uh, it should be robot at macroscope.com, not eocortex. So, Peter, uh, I would request you to try once again. And I guess I made a spelling mistake there. Uh, I missed on C. So Simon has offered you a new email account, uh, email address uh, with correct spelling of uh, microscope in there. 
I am really sorry, Peter, for my mistake. Now, new new email account has been shared with you by my colleague uh, Simon. So it it is robot at microscope dot com, and if you have queries, please uh, write to this email account and your queries will be answered. It is a great solution that can help uh, to take off any uh, human involved with monitor's job of just checking if there is any gap or not, if there, there is a price tag placed to its place or not. So it will be really helpful. I guess the no more questions are coming in so we uh, can say bye to each other so I will be uh, closing this webinar now uh, I'm really uh, thankful to all of you for coming and paying attention to our software and the solution that could be very useful to uh, get prospective bias thank you all